Ooh. Hello everyone, how are you guys doing? Welcome to the stream. I don't even know what day today is, I think it's Thursday. I saw live from Panama. Through the tubes. Tigo. Let's see if Tigo lets me do my thing in peace. Welcome everyone, KCW, Kingston Pasta, Big Steak, Shayami Gaming. Thank you guys for joining. Everyone that's lurking, I appreciate you all. My neck, oh my god, what the fuck's wrong with my neck? Oof, that's what 900 hours of creep do to you. Casey, you got the FC boat. Work hard. Get monies. Let's see, let's get your boat in here. How you all doing? How's your day going, guys? Yo, Shayami, huge emote. Let's go. Thank you for that. That's such a cute emote. Maiden. From Maiden's channel. That's some lovely emotes right there. It's a cute animal waifu. Very pretty. Thank you for the big emote, Shayami. How can I close this? What's going with Twitch, man? Twitch? It's smaller here. Yeah, it is very big. They look really crisp. I guess that's why, that's why Twitch asks you when you blow them, you can make them bigger. So when they do like the giant emote thing, they look crisp. They look uh, neat. But yeah, hope you're all doing great. Let's see, we have our chat window here. So KCW, first chatter. Casey, your first chatter is for this. I imagine. Ooh. <laughs> so good, look. My lips are shut though. Let's do it. Rift of the Necrons. Thank you, Casey. We have Shayami. The the giant emote is 15 bitties. So that's bad. Timmy, I see you there. How are you doing? Welcome. Uh, I wanted to say something before. Well, let me let me fire some raiders up. Yeah, I don't know. My neck is still stiff. I thought I was better. I stayed home yesterday. It didn't work out. My, my shoulders were in a lot of pain. At least I can raise the arms again easily. But then rotating to the left side, to the right side is fine. But to the left side, it's... It hurts. I think I have a contracture. God damn it. Let's see, we have a quest. Mm -mm. Where is my quest? 50 gold coins. So yeah, I mean, have you played Woodering Waves? It looks so much like Genshin. I haven't played any gacha in a while. I even parked my princesses. As sad as that is. Let me start the battle here. Okay, we have waters again. Not this one, not this one. This one. This one here is a, it's a good water. I think there is fine. Timmy, how are you doing today? And pasta? My glasses got like scratched. Big say, how you doing? How you doing? I want was a stain on a scratch, but there's a scratch for sure. She's so getting ready to head to the pool for the third day in a row. So tired of the pool. So tired of the life. I bet the kids have a lot of energy, right? Big Steak, busy, busy, so much work. God damn. Well, Big Steak, thank you for... She'll do that today. Let's go. Get some PBR. Let's go. Pool and PBR. That sounds great. How's Shaggy? How's the baby? When grandparents come to town, the pool, we must go. Okay. Okay. Family time. That's precious time. Happy to hear that. But yeah, let's go and take a look at the showcase. The pain is 
fucking annoying. You're on a diet, no beer, maybe rum. Just a shot. Just one shot of Barcelo. So you get okay. Now you're in the happy zone. Big sick and enjoy the rest of the day. And besides, you deserve You've been working your ass off, man. You've been working hard. Like Duo here. Yo, 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 Duo, what's up? Duo, what chapter are you in Final Fantasy VII Remake? Uh, last time I checked, you were in like under the plates on the other mission to the reactor. I mind you already finished that part. You were saying like, this is a maze. It's not a maze, it's so linear. There's just like a little few branching paths where you get some loot. The game's pretty linear, but you will you get used to it. Your how's the combat treating you? Finishing A doing the side quest, nice. Down ten pounds, another five to go or so with one. Do the riba diet, chicken and broccoli. It's getting a bit stale, but today I air fry the chicken breast. I normally just boil the chicken. That's as stale as you can get. Hospital grade chicken breast. Let's go. Yeah, it's such a good, it's a fun game. It's a fun game. I hope you're enjoying it, too. When I'm, I'm always trying to check your streams because I have a lot of fun watching you play uh, Final Fantasy VII. Let's see. We have. But yeah, that that's good progress, big sick, with the diet. Are you are you lifting? Yeah, I'm lifting baby. <laughs> and Shaggy. Oh, who's a good boy? Let's see what we got here. Man, that the pools, the, the, the kitty and the doggy, so cute. I just love them too much. It's a nice little wiener there. Well, not that little. It's actually a nice wiener. Uh, we counted votes. Look, Fury went up one position. At number 16, Fury is pretty high. So this is top 10. Fury is like toot, 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 around here. So if it has like a few more games to climb, but it might get into the top 10. Uh, Legend of Dragoon still comfy at the top. Jump King. Look, Jump King crossed 9.3k, so the gap is smaller now. I guess we're gonna, we might see Jump King this year, duo. We might play Jump King this year. The Ravi strategy. This strategy will help you beat every Elden Ring, Shadow of the Earth Tree boss. Number one, hit the boss. Number two, don't let the boss hit you. Number three, repeat. That's the Ravi strategy. And you know what's the funny part? Ravi... Ravi uh, sucks at gaming. But yeah, he said stuff, stuff like, this one's easy, just hitting, like with a typo even. Several times and dodges attacks. Ravi that giving me pro tips on how to defeat bosses in games. Let's see, Pasta, you made some progress with your art as well. Some colors there, noise. Pasta, I'm so happy to see your, your arts again. Pasta art. Nice palette there. Nice palette you got going in there. Humidity is trying to kill you. What, what's wrong with do AC? It's humid as fuck here. Air is like soup. Canadian soup. Yum, Canadian soup. What's the national soup of Canada? Big say we we have poutine. Well, do you have a soup like a traditional soup there? It probably has beans. Canadian beans. I don't know what I'm talking. About. I want to shut the fuck up. Pasta working on Arta. Waiting on a callback. I see Big say I'm waiting a lot. Uh, walking a lot. Shaggy going to walk around the mall. Etc. Also doing ring fit. Let's go. That's good. Ring fit sounds like a fun way to burn extra calories. So if you mind what you eat and you do all the walking, you will probably lose the weight fast. But if you don't, don't you have like a, do you, can, do you have dumbbells or a kettlebell or something so you can do some, you know, maybe get, a, if you get a little bit more muscle, since that's a metabolically active tissue, it will help you burn even more. Let's fucking go. But I'm proud of you, Big C. Keep it up. Besides, with the feast you share, you need to get ready for the feast. I see Carly, how you doing? I see your votes. Hey, Vampire Survivors, pretty close to climbing another one. Look, remember yesterday was like 30 away, it's just 14 votes. Lifting weights fucked up my diet really good. You get hungry. If you have more muscle, you will... But that's the thing. You can eat more. Depending on what you were doing. But if you get more muscle and you're active, like training almost every day or four times per week or something like that trust me you will need that food 
you shouldn't unless you're starting to eat like low quality bullshit like donuts and but if you eat like a lot of like protein you can even put carbs in there because once you start lifting you will do you do need the carbs there won't be any muscle growth with just protein you, the, the muscles need carbs as well that's why you see all these weight gain supplements for for muscle gain like a glass of that thing has like 2000 calories and those guys won't get won't get fat because they do need that the, the extra calories but yeah it, it needs to be a balance it needs to be a balance um see since part of my preparations uh in the for this mid long term project but learning a, a bit about nutrition as well yeah exactly it is just energy so as long as you use the energy but the macronutrients have different uh, properties as far as how they metabolize into energy or the, the stuff your body needs to, to function like some people have a misconception like if you eat fatty stuff like a spoon of lard you merely will put that's not how it works it's, it won't go and get stored in your belly as fat tissue it's even that is, that is energy too so in fact the, the excess calories that you don't burn be it from carbs or whatever over time your liver your, your organism will turn that into fat uh, tissue reserves you do need fat actually yeah you know fat is important like neurotransmitters the, the cellular membranes yeah because people uh, associate the name with that but it's not how it works like and I don't necessarily encourage people to like macro uh, micromanage calorie count everything they eat that's not necessary even we, we all have basic requirements and at least 1.5 thousand a day and for most people that's probably already a bit hypocaloric the stop with is exactly the same yeah yeah it won't immediately transform because some people have that oh I ate a pizza so tomorrow I'll have like uh, one inch in my waist that's not how it works it has to be a sustained thing over time you're eating more calories than you burn if you're doing hardcore training macros are very good to keep track of but if you're just trying to lose weight be healthy it's all a numbers game don't worry really that's about it exactly eat less calories than you burn that's it over a long period of time that depending on how you do it and if you throw exercise in the mix the, the weight loss can go a bit faster but that's how i lost all the weight i wanted to lose just by stopping all sugary drinks and walking a lot at least five between five to ten k steps every day no more coke if i have coke it's always coke zero water coffee black no sugar i stop coffee with like cream and sugar and milk and just black black coffee no sugar just by cutting the sugary drinks yeah they have a lot and if you check the ingredient label on, on like almost everything has added sugar in some form so be careful with that like I, I like peanut butter a lot peanut butter is also a good source of some fatty acids you need and it's also high protein so like a portion has like seven grams well depending on the the brand and all that but it's good stuff I think calorie counting can help educate each individual uh, the calorie value soon yeah yeah but once you get an estimate like because I see people get obsessed with oh I ate five more calories than I should from rice two more grains of rice just, fuck up shut the fuck up like you know it's not like people get like really hardcore with that stuff god damn it what the fuck I'm getting so many messages sorry for screen. If I get a lot of, if you're doing hardcore training, ah, don't worry, that's about it. In calorie counting, okay. Yeah, especially the, uh, uh, when you're getting. When I went to the gym back home in Venezuela, I got a nutritionist. That's when I started really getting serious. I lost a lot of weight. I was very chubby. I think I was like more than a hundred kilos, like probably like a hundred and ten. In my, like I got really. I lost all my clothes. It wasn't. I need to stop. I'm putting a lot of weight. So, 
And the nutritionist was included with the gym, so well, what, what might as well use her services, right? So she gave me guidelines and stuff. And like you say, when you're learning, like, oh, I know that 100 grams of chicken, you have around 30 grams of protein and the calorie count is this and that. And you can get like a rough idea. At the start, it's very good because but now when you see a dish, you can kind of estimate, oh, that lunch has like 500 calories. So just by looking at it, because you already know at least you can ballpark estimate and that helps a lot. The aim for 10,000 steps a day is hard. Yeah, sometimes if you don't go out of your way to walk, you won't get there. Like, I mean, I spend a few hours here streaming, three, four, five hours, whatever. When I go out, it's like to the gym, very close. If I just do my daily routine of streaming, going to, but the thing in the gym, I burn easy. 300 calories 400 depending on what sometimes the workouts have several rounds of calories in the machine so some some workouts are more cardio more more stamina endurance and the, then we have the weightlifting stuff but weightlifting does burn a lot of calories people don't, don't, don't realize that but it's a lot of exercise as well but that would probably be a day where i walk like a, a thousand steps so when i go buy groceries and stuff then i get four or five k easy but I should probably go back to the daily walks. But I feel like with the daily workouts I'm doing is plenty. But steps always good for you, man. Move the, the skeleton and the muscles and all that. Walking is such an underrated uh, exercise. Timmy, are you pregnant? What? Juan, how are you doing? I didn't say hi, thanks. And Carly, lovely to have you here. Oh, about the lo losing control thing. Cleo, thank you for the epic Orc Slayer. See, I mean, when little steak starts running around. Oh, shit. Lambda is here. Micronutrients are also important, but I'm also nerd and it's good that people are doing anything. Exactly. A lot of people don't do... I remember we, we did a Saturday workout, which I normally do Monday through Friday because I'm so sore when the weekend I need that rest. You know, rest is important too, but I, I once went and did a, sat a Saturday workout and the coach was like we were like three people only me and a couple more and it was like at 9 a.m. or something that day I didn't stream or I streamed later <laughs> and people were like oh I am so tired and, uh, and dude you, most people are sleeping right now you should be proud that you're here moving your body like like Landis. getting do something done is better than the average probably Lambda, Lambda, great to have you here. I agree with Carly. Good to see you, man. Yeah, if you get used to drinking stuff with a sugar, you do your body a huge favor. Absolutely. Van, what's up, Van? How are you doing? Getting some boats in. Checking the backlog. You're averaging 11,000 a day. Oof, that's epic, Timmy. That's a lot of steps. Lambda, I'm good. Thanks for asking. Hope you're well, too. Let's go, Lambda. I'm glad to hear you're good, man. Thank you for joining us. Do you have any Batman Arkham games? I do. Van, I do. I actually I actually streamed. One of the first games I streamed was Batman Arkham Asylum, which I need to go back to it. I played 15 hours and got 18 Chivas. So yeah, you can vote for Batman Arkham Asylum if you want. One of my long overdue... I will probably just start because I don't remember what I was doing. It's been years. It's been years. It's been, since it's been 84 years. Yeah, but well, good to see you, Van. And let's see, we have Kurt Chemical. What's up, gang? How you doing, Kurt? Welcome. Lambda, chronometer.com. Corona Rigger Meter. This is a good resource for starting to track micronutrients. Can learn a lot from you. It's even looking once at the nutrients in what you eat. I used to have a pota potassium. Pot 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 how do you pronounce that? I just say K. And we feel better now that I've taken care of. Dude, I want I wor I wonder if I have a, a deficiency of some micronutrients because I am only taking vitamin C and zinc and I'm eating um, an omega-3 for the fatty acids. But my diet has been just chicken and broccoli. I'm probably like an eggs. I eat eggs in the morning, but I feel like I'm lacking something. Maybe that's why I get so exhausted in the evenings. And you know, I used to be very like high energy in the mornings, but it, I don't have maybe just exhaustion from the workouts. But maybe I'm lacking some shit. I will I will check that out, Lambda. Thank you for the resource. 
Let me bookmark. I might need some supplements, to be honest. I don't know if just chicken breast and broccoli and eggs is gonna cover it. Bam, you have a three stream straight, let's go. And you got a six pack for ba Batman, let's go, nice. Yeah, I pronounce it K because that's the chemical symbol of it. Chronometer, it's free, okay. Cause you know, I, I like free stuff. I like free stuff because free stuff allows me to not pay for using it. <laughs> I, I'm broke, man. That's why I'm, I'm I, Lambda, you know that I'm looking for a job. I'm hunting jobs. Chronometer. You know what? Let me put this in my list here. So. I got another follow up, but it's being rough. I, I, it's getting it's harder than I anticipated, to be honest. Chicken, broccoli, and egg alone better than most. I know how it's not being able to afford a lot of stuff. Yeah, bro, that... I think I mentioned last month I was doing a lot of paperwork, so it was related to my residency and work permit and all that stuff, so... I don't think I ever told the story about that, but I think... I can do it now because... Job, I stream a cutback. Yeah, dude, I, I am in a lot of debt. I, and also that, that that expenses have gotten out of hand and... I need to help my brother out as well, so he helps me, I help him, you know how it is, but yeah, your votes are, are safe, man, don't worry, they get counted, they get immediately added to the spreadsheet, but yeah, I had to, basically to make a the long story short, and I don't wanna, because it's very sensitive, I kept that hidden, not many people knew, but there were a few, I was under... I was basically out of status. I was illegal here for a while because I got um, both me and Tisha. Tisha is fine. We managed to salvage her uh, process. But we got like, a, we got conned by a lawyer here in Panama to do all sorts of like uh, migra immigration paperwork. You need lawyers. You can do on your own. like. They, they need a signature of a lawyer, they need to be notarized, and so you can apply, like for example, as far as I know in Canada, for example, for transparency, you can do everything on your own. But here in Panama, it's like, um, it's like a very corrupt and obtuse process and you need a lawyer, and of course lawyers have fees. And So the first lawyer we used, which was perfect, we got our papers in order, everything was fine. Um, he stopped working with us. And then I went with his partner. And that guy just fucking stole our money. So basically, I was that was a few years ago. And I tried, I got in contact with my previous lawyer. We tried, I, is there a way I can fucking sue this motherfucker? He just stole, won't say the amount, but it was a substantial amount of money. And too long didn't read, we never got the money back. So that was the money needed to like sort my stuff. So I spent a while without without papers. Now I feel comfortable talking about it because I have my fucking residency. I won't show it close because this is the equivalent of a green card in the US world. And I got my work permit too. But um, too long didn't read, like that was a lot of money. I had to ask friends and my brother and I already capped all my credit cards. So I feel that it's, it is a mess. That the system here is not great. It's, it's, um, it's designed, it, it, once you start digging. Oh yeah, I know, people get scammed. Dude, my mom fell victim to one of the scams. And Abby, how you doing? I didn't say hi. Uh, welcome to the stream. My mom, rest in peace. My mom, dude. Like, I, I always wonder whoever fell for those like banners. I don't know if you see them. Probably you still see them sometimes online. But I haven't seen them in a while, but you had these banners, like interactive, you know, like you can click and stuff. Like they had like three faces, like Jesus Christ, Mickey Mouse, and Obama. 
and the banner said like, who is the president of the US? And if you move the cursor, you have, it was like a hand and you could click on the, the faces. And of course, my mom was like, she clicking Obama. She knew that by, back then Obama was the president of the US. And boom, it opened a website, shady as fuck, of course. Congratulations, you guessed right. If you know who the US president is, that means you're ready to apply for the, the residency and some stuff, blah, blah. And my mom was like, oh my God, I can get like a, a green car and shit. Guess what she did? My mom? I love my mommy, but tech savvy was not and, and like, she was too, you know, good faith. And she, she, she legit thought she won like a, an opportunity to get a green card. So next thing, you know, what, what is the next thing these websites ask for you? Credit card details. So she went, pick my dad's credit card, doo -doo 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 -doo, put everything. Completely forgot about the thing. And my dad started getting those like, ouch, it's like super ouch. And they were not big charges, but still like wasted money, like $80 every month or something like that. My dad noticed like at the third month, like the fuck is this? And then it, it was a mess to cancel. And you know what's worse? Those are legit business. You can't sue anyone. You click the banner, you went to the website, you fill the form, you just lost of money. It's like legal fraud. Even you go to like US immigration services, citizenship and immigration service, whatever, and read. We don't, uh, it says something like, these services are not required, so don't use them, blah, blah, blah. Apply directly to the official channels like embassy through the US CIS website, whatever. Department of State, if it's a visa, all that stuff. So you don't need like third parties, but at the same time, it's not illegal. Like, what the fuck? The easiest way to get money. Green cards like kind of like proper. But I mean, it's different for paying the money in every country, I guess. But some are worse than others. Some are worse than others. Yeah, I got it sorted, Lambda, thankfully, because to be honest, like I never mentioned that because like I said, it was very sensitive, but I was figuring out how to get back on track. Like I said, we managed to find a lawyer that salvaged because the, the, the guy that scammed us just disappeared with my money. So I had to scramble. We found another lawyer that, okay, send me all your stuff. It's gonna be this much money. And we tried to, we had like, a, the deadline was looming for renewing everything. When the guy just disappeared with all our money. And we managed to salvage only Tisha. So she, she has already her like, uh, she has a permanent residency. She even has like the ID from here. So I think she can like in the next couple years or something, she can become a, a citizen even. For me, I'm now a resident again, but I won't be able to become a citizen for a few years. But at least I can now apply for regular jobs again and all that stuff. So I it was not in my plans, but it was such an expensive ordeal that I need an extra reliable source of income. That's the thing. I love Twitch, but I have great months and then there's months that I barely make the payout. And it's very, it's gonna be impossible for me to save any money, to pay the debts with the Twitch income, as, at least as it is right now. So I am, that's the reason. That's the reason I am looking for a job now, again. Sort of real, so sorry. Thank you, Abby, but it, it's fine, it's fine. You know, I'm always, even during that time, I was, you saw me, you saw me streaming. I never like made a big fuss about it because first I know that here in this country and everywhere there's hundreds of thousands of people that are in a similar situation and a lot of them are hardworking people. I was just fortunate that I found a way to solve it. Yeah, content creation is, is shaky, man. You know, I was seeing numbers from big YouTubers, like with hundreds of thousands of, like two, three hundred thousand subs. Yeah, I don't have a concrete plan yet, but my plan until I find something, Lambda, will be business as usual. I try to stream six days a week like I'm doing. 
do my commissions on the side. That's how I managed to stay afloat all this time. Um, once I get a job, I don't know if it's going to be a part-time or a full-time job. I'm not picky. Whatever I find that is convenient. Like I say, if it's something that's too far away from where I live and I have to spend a huge chunk of the income in transportation, I will just stream until I find something closer that works. Uh, if I have to take public transportation, that's fine. But if I have to like hail cabs or Uber or whatever, it will be too much money to, to be convenient. Um, yeah, business as usual. And if I get the job or when I get the job, Lambda, I will probably work out a schedule. I don't plan to stop streaming. I want to emphasize that because some people have asked. Oh, are you are you ending your stream? No, no, no. I love streaming. I have put too much effort and too much time building this uh, community together with you also over the years. So I have no plans to stop. It will probably come back to something like I had at the start when I had my job, like two or three days a week, probably in the evenings, a couple hours, similar to what Dave does, for example. So I, I won't stop, but I, I will probably have to figure out a new schedule and. Uh, Minty Pie, how you doing? Good to see you. They feel as like you have to be active in two areas. And Twitch today sounds more like a way to promote something as you're doing, like our YouTube. Yeah, you have to diversify your income. It can be only the platform where you put your content out because that's... Like I say, I saw the income reports of YouTubers that have... Two or three hundred thousand subscribers. And they were getting like a, a couple grand a month, sometimes more, but it's depending where you live. Here for me, that will be royal. Here in Panama, you can expect like seven, eight hundred dollars if you're lucky a month from a, most jobs. But I know here, someone that earns two or three thousand a month is fine. You can live fine with that here. But I know in the US, that might not cut it. If you have a car, if you have car payments. The mortgage, you have, or rent, and then food, and then utilities, and then if you have kids or a pet or that insurance, like that's probably not enough. You will miss it stop. Yeah, I don't plan to stop anytime soon, Minty, because I just love it way too much. It's something I plan to do for as long as I can. I, I just love streaming. It's been magical to me, like, made so many friends the stuff I have learned and the connections. It's just too valuable to not do. I, I won't stop. They're probably doing something wrong. But that's the thing. There's no magic formula because you keep saying that, oh, I could fucking do it. Like, I'm not I'm not saying I'm a skeptical of you, Lambda, but there's a shitload of people trying to, and like 0.1% might get to that point where they get two or $3,000 from. It's like... It is not easy. So if you come here telling me, it, so you say you know what you need to then fucking do it and prove it to me, and I will shut my mouth because it is not easy. I know a lot of people that upload daily or they fucking play the meta game, the thumbnails, A and B, blah blah. They they never get there. I don't think there's a formula. I don't, I don't think there's a way to the algorithm. Whatever people say about the algorithm is just a speculation or experimentation because. You have nothing to prove. You don't have anything to prove for real, but what I mean is that I, I feel you say a lot of stuff like I can make a video that gets 100,000 views. Like, do it. I want to see it. I want to see it for for real because I, when you put the Jamie video there, I I watch it like a million times. It's, ooh, the lamb to speak is so funny, man. But anyway, um, I think the only one that really knows what's going on with the algorithm is a fucking guy that works at YouTube. And that's like industrial trade secret, so no one knows. Everyone's just speculating. Because if someone knew, it would be easy to be another Mr. Beast. And guess what? There's only one Mr. Beast. So, and it could even be that beyond the quality of the content or virality of the content or whatever, because this is a business as well. So it could even be that the YouTube algorithm, because someone is there coding, the but it's not open source. So no one except the people that work at Google have access to it. And everyone else is, like I said, speculating and pulling stuff out of their ass. And whatever research 
or studies you can do by using that tool, which is not conclusive. It's just like, and they can change. And if you get on the right track, they might be able to change stuff again. So whatever you were using might not work in the new algorithm. But yeah, what, what I was saying is that probably the people there say, this guy is bringing a lot of money. Let's boost him. So probably Google or YouTube is also part of why this guy is so huge. Like not only the quality of the content, oh, he figured out. He might have some help from, from within, you know? Because they want him to be big because they get more money too. Let's see, uh, Young Mong, I make some clickbait thumbnail. They might work, but they might do shit. That's why I say, because there's no formula. Like, you know, Mr. B, some people were copying his thumbnail, like the face, like, that super cringe smile, like, you know, he goes like, something like that in every thumbnail. You do that shit, you get two views. He does it, 50 million views in one hour. Like, already, he's already big, of course, on that. I mean, the lol. <laughs> it's funny, it's funny. So yeah, I don't, what, what I do as far as my content creation is just try to be consistent. If I say I'm gonna stream every day, I try to be there every day, try not to cancel the stream, um, try to bring similar vibes and energy. Um, Cause I'm a, I'm a believer there's no formula for success on any of this. Like first, not many people make it. Now, YouTube has 170 million channels. Last time I checked, probably only 0.01% of those are able to generate enough money to live comfortably. And then out of that percentage, like a 5% of those that is already like a micro segment of all the channels that exist are like the millionaires because the Mr. Beasts, the PewDiePie, the... So if you're going into that space, uh, and I don't, because I think like having big dreams and aspirations is really cool. And if you have the drive to pursue that to the end, that there's lots to respect about that hard work ethic and and willing to reinvent yourself and, and, and change stuff until you figure it out. Um, but I don't think there's a formula for that success. Like, cause a lot of people do the work, put the content, are consistent, make great art for the thumbnails, never make it. So that's why I, I don't think there's a secret sauce. And you remember Ninja, the streamer? Tyler Blevins, or he, he was like doing courses and shit. I don't believe a single big streamer made the, like, I mean, he was diversifying, which I respect as well, but, and you know why I think it doesn't work? Because there's no formula. So whatever Ninja can come and share, about because I openly share my experience as a streamer in six years. Some people say, Reeves, you've made it. You're a full timer. You stream six days a week. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm still winging it, figuring it out. So I can put a rips course to become a streamer and people pay $50 for that. They apply, okay, I'm gonna stream four days a week, never miss a stream, blah, blah, blah. You might grow, you might not grow. I can't guarantee anything. There's no formula. Anyway, I hope you can afford to keep, no, I will never stop streaming, Abby. That's all my plans. If I don't find a job, I will continue because it is my source, main source of income. If I find a job, I will still stream less frequently and less hours per week, but I won't stop. I just love it way too much. Devil man, I need to catch up to chat here. I probably miss a bunch of messages. There is, in my opinion, so many things that impact what you need to get enough money. That, yeah, there's no magic formula. There is no formula. Whoever comes to you and says that there's, you do this, 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 and that, there might be things that you can do that increase your chance, but there is no surefire way of be Twitch, YouTube, becoming a huge account on Instagram. No way. There are factors that, that might aid you, but as soon as there, if there, if someone cracks the code, but then there's another problem that is why maybe some people are cynical about the growth stuff. Like I always say like, the zero sum or scarcity mentality like 
the market size, the potential audience, it's a number, it's not infinite. And people have the same amount of hours every day, the same amount of hours that they can spend watching content, sharing content, or uh, a limited amount of, of money that can be used for like subscriptions or tips or whatever. So in that sense, I kind of get where they are coming from. I just hate that way of thinking, so. Uh, from what I saw, most people that can live out of Twitch are popular because something else, like famous YouTubers, for example, or artists. Yeah, some have made it, ha have made their fame or notoriety with Twitch, but it's just few and far between. And like I'd say, my the reason I pursued full time is because my reality living here in Panama. If I was in Canada. When I lost my job, I would have never jumped full time. I would have immediately tried to get a job. The reason is that, and I told this story several times on, on, on Curb's podcast, on Juice's podcast, here on my streams plenty of times, is that the cost of living here and the salaries are not, it was realistic. I actually got there. I, I surpassed that. I was earning more money from Twitch than I was earning on my day job that's not the same reality anymore and it's just strange because I think the regional pricing and the the, pri the regional pricing the, the I think they changed the, the, but that was recent from prime income um, I don't know what they are tweaking or changing turbo or whatever but even if I have maintained my, my my growth and subscribers and all that, the income has never recovered. It's actually gone down. So it's very opaque, by the way, how they, they're just shafting you in a way. I understand that they don't have, um, they are not profitable. They are probably barely keeping this thing afloat. They're just burning through money to keep it online probably because it's for better or for worse is still the biggest streaming platform so and now we have kick and the, well youtube gaming and facebook well i think facebook is cutting down on that by the way young monk now i'm wondering how they call the algorithm good question if you knew they probably put a hit on you man there's a thing now in france with some uh, youtubers stealing content from english just recording their voice over knowing that most people never see the original because they don't speak english well, but that thing will probably change because now YouTube, I think, has AI dubbing. And there's companies that dub videos like for um, any language you need. And AI is advancing at such a rapid pace that we'll probably get some real-time dubbing and stuff that will be really good quality. Most of it is hard work and mostly luck. Yeah, hard work part, that's what I try to do because that's what's under my control. Luck, I am not a believer in luck. I don't f I mean, I know what you mean, but it's say opportunity instead of luck. Because luck implies like, like today you wake up and whatever force of destiny just roll a die and you got the luck, you got the natural 20 and now's the day when you're gonna get raided by a 70,000 viewer huge streamer and and you will get to the excerto or whatever the fuck and you will grow so i don't know if that's a thing like luck like i think luck only is like where you were born and to whom like for example i was born in venezuela which is not a great country so not much opportunity and you know it's, that's why i move here and that's why i still as uh, as as soon as I don't have anything that, uh, if I have the possibility, of course. Because right now I don't plan to move anywhere because I need to take care of my dad and my dad lives here. My dad can't move anywhere in his condition. So, um, but other than where were you born and to whom, I don't think there's luck plays that big of, that's my opinion. I know a lot of people do believe in that. Oh, but there's 
like of course if you were born in a rich city to a high middle class or rich family in a developed country you have her absolutely fucking lutely so that that's luck you were born there but once you're out of the womb it's just your choices and that you say hard work if you were born in venezuela instead of like like i said in i don't know vancouver or or in switzerland or or norway or then you have to work 5x to be able to move to those places and then but you can do it people have done it countless times but i i don't i don't know i don't know luck makes me feel i don't believe in luck I don't believe in luck because I think like luck is a catch all like people blame oh I don't have luck. He started streaming later than me and he got lucky and like maybe there's some truth to that but I don't I feel like most people use the concept of luck like for like an excuse maybe. So to me it's like in the same back as the people that blame oh she got big because she has big Titties, titties streamers stealing my viewers. You know, people get lame and fucking cringe. Like, when when is the total opposite? Like, women have a harder time. Like, if you check the top 20 streamers, like, 19 are guys, fat chubby guys with beards and shit. Like, if I were, you know. So, it's not true. It's not true that if you're a good-looking girl and have big booba, you're instantly successful. Then a lot of nerds that want, oh, because she has 80 viewers and I have five, is because she has booba. So, uh, this is weird. Luck, luck to me is a weird concept. I don't believe in luck. I do believe in being there, showing up, and that is tied to hard work. Because if you stream every day, then the chance that you get rated by a big one, that you get noticed by a big uh, community, that something cool or viral or funny happens on your stream and then gets shared and brings more people in but that is not luck that is it happened because you were there and you seized the opportunity or you had the the wits you know to come up with something that became viral or whatever i think you're uh, mr beast abby anyway how you can thank you abby you're the sweetest kurt i think your own personality plays a great role in that success the vibe the way you connect with people absolutely i think that's very important if you're a community-driven streamer, like, that's my case. Because I know there are streamers that have 600 viewers that don't know anything about anyone in chat. They just play a game, they're speedrunners or eSport player or whatever, and that's absolutely fine. It's a whole different thing. The people that tune in to watch that streamer, they watch. They want to watch the gameplay. They don't want to connect with him on a... Phone call. Okay, let me pick this up. As you know, I mean, the job hunt is a number and it could be something. Let me pick this up. Be
Google. Guys, sorry for that, but I did get a phone call from a job opportunity. So yeah, they're gonna send me an email with some more requirements to follow up. I don't know if this is the one. Looks kinda cool, so. But I won't, I won't jinx anything. I, won't, I, say I don't believe in luck, but until I get something concrete, I won't be saying anything. Let me catch up to chat here. Oh, we have Streamraiders Battle. We can do the Streamraiders while I check chat. Let's see. Uh, there's a thing now in France or something. Okay, I was reading that. Let me just... Daffy, what's up? How you doing? Abby, I want to get a shouty for you, Abby. How you been? Start getting some love in here for our community. Now we have a lot of streamers. We need to get one for Kurt. Let's see, Abby, Miss, I hope you can afford to keep streaming. We will be keeping streaming. I won't stop streaming. The, the schedule may vary. I don't know if the job I'll get, you know, there's some rotative schedules and stuff. But we'll figure it out. I won't stop streaming at all. Let's see. I think novelty can be a factor too. There's gotta be something that grabs a viewer's attention. Probably. But it's hard to measure. It's so hard to measure. That's why I say there's no formula for it. I'll show you my factor, my beans. Don't do it, John Monk. Or, or do it rather. <laughs> Please so, don't. Look here, it's like, don't do it, man. Needy me, to Needy, how you doing, Nando? Welcome to the stream, Kurt. We know it's big. You don't need to show. Exactly. Here's the garlic king himself. Carly, I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna go grab lunch. Have a great stream. Thank you, Carly. Enjoy your lunch. Bow before your majesty, the meatus. By the way, the mystery code thing forms a crown from location in... Oh, shit. So, like a map. I saw there were some degrees, like latitude and stuff. God damn, the codes. Let's see. Um, how you doing? I'm doing good, Kurt. You can roam if you want. Ooh, ooh. Kurt, ready to? I think this is going the way as well. I'll have to pixelize the fact. Yeah. Censorship. Oh shit, Cleo, look at Cleo on fire here, got all the boats. Team Yakuza on a roll here. Dave, how you doing? I see you there in chat. So let me see, Cleo, the Sinrares boat. Devilman, yo. Devilman, what's up, how you doing? I guess the public can handle my factor, troll face. I don't know if I can handle it, Jongmong, to be honest. Minty pie, as in being in the right place at the right time. Yes, that I agree with, but that's opportunity. I, I like the word opportunity more because you were present. So I was reading a, an essay about that. Like some people say, but my, my luck has, my opportunity has left me. Like they were using the analogy of a train or a ship. And then someone came, I think it's more like the subway. You just come at intervals, but you need to be there. You need to show up in the station. But the train comes every four or five minutes or whatever. Just make sure you see it and you get on. But if you don't show, if you're not in the station, you see the analogy, then you will always miss it. And will be always like, oh, some people are lucky. No, they, they aren't lucky. They were just there. And they got in the train. Some days you get lucky, but you gotta take advantage of luck when it happens. Exactly, you gotta take advantage of opportunity when it shows up in your door. But if you were never there in the first place, it will never come knocking. And you can also get lucky and doesn't do anything too. Exactly, like maybe you get that 17,000 viewer rate and only five people follow, and of those five, two unfollow, and only one comes back ever again. It can happen too. But at least you got a nice little move the needle in the ad revenue for a couple hours, maybe, or... I think I'm ready for that jelly, if you get my reference. Maybe I was thinking of a Claire Google. Minty, oh, you're already lurking. I'm probably missing. Uh, have a great day, Minty. Anyway, you can't control dog. You got to put the energy into things that depend on your actions. It's the only thing you can do, actually, so that's why I focus on that. Gem puts the shirt and hides the titties. Oh, you are too beautiful, man. You don't even need the tatas. Let's see. It was her science final. Oh, shit. That's so cool. Man, they help. She did awesome. Let's see. Needy, that's me. Me too. So I have 10 and I don't know anything about them. Because they are lurkers. 
Nah, because I don't even remember what I ate last night. <laughs> oh my god, Nitty. I think my only shot these days is to become a TD streamer. Boog. I mean, if they don't talk, it would be difficult to know about them. You know what? Let's do the next battle, so... And I should jump into the... Oh, shit. It's gonna be noon soon. Hey, non-binary. How you doing? Great to see you. Also, good morning, old Jim. How you doing today? Hope you're having a good Thursday. Did they publish... Nitty, what is a free game today in Epic Game Store? You know, they're giving free games every Thursday. My time at Sandrock. Let's go. I think they added that to Game Pass as well. Look, my time at Bot... Bot Rock. Oh, Big Say already conquered that game. 100% achievements. Queen, Slay the Spire. Let's go. No, I was not on a launch break. I was getting a phone call. You know, I've been doing this job hunt thing, so I got a phone call. And it might be a good lead. It might be promising. So I'm going to go and keep you guys posted. That would be great because the job hunt has not been that easy. I have probably submitted my CV and and emails, letters, whatever, to like 50 or 60 jobs in the last couple days. And only like two or three have uh, ha have gotten back to me. And you know, getting back, then you have to filter further and it's a process for sure. Hey, Needy, Jam, Jong Mong, everyone else I am missing. Queen, how are you doing today? <laughs> Let's see, bots, but. Hope, but you're doing a, ma a maze, but. Don't hide, stay with us. Slay that spire. I hear of a maze boss, but a maze boss is a first. That's your favorite kind of butt. A maze butt, Nitty. Urban Dictionary says a woman with an amazing R's. Okay. Every woman, let's go. Big round butt. It's too early for that. I am not going to argue. Let's go. But. Man, butts was on fire today. Gem, I swear, bot, so go back to harassing Neri. Leave me alone. Leave me, leave Gem alone, bot, bot. Fuck with Neri. Daffy Trails, you guys are funny. Abby, you're the best. Thank you so much for hanging out. See, I'm sorry for that long interruption. I had to pick that phone call. Let's see. Oh, shit, that's a giant. Bot emote. That's so good, man. That's very sparkly, very shiny. I like it. It's ready for it's prime for a for a slap. See Tiffy, Tiffy, you finished before G. I was watching you play Persona, but I was lurky because I am like super hardcore job hunting and and, and working. That looks like a great bot ready for a slap. Thank you, Daffy. Dave, how are you doing today, man? Winning the gamble. Let's go. Oh yeah, the Rue alphabet. The runic alphabet for the Rus. Clipless grenade, how we're doing good, my dude. Tomorrow night, let's go. Dave, it's so good watching you play Warcraft, man. I I'm looking forward for more ease as well. But tomorrow, I actually need to talk to Ravi. I don't know if I'll make it tomorrow. Google Beluga. Chattanooga. Because I have an event. Is that the birthday of the coach at the gym? Andy Caramela Mordor giving a meatiest, moistest, ripsiest hug. So, Royal Thing comeback, maybe. Oh shit. You mentioned the crown thing. Man, the insomnia, they destroy those codes real fast. I mean, they are so thirsty and hungry for Dreamcatcher content. Whatever they throw their way, there's. <laughs> Destroyed fast. Yo, how's that rumble? The, the characters for the Twitch streamer rumble coming. The Dave. It's the White Sox. Let's go. Abby, I'm excited to get to know everyone here better. We have a really cool community, Abby. I'm glad you're part of it. We need to get to know you better as well. But guys, be sure to follow Abby. She also streams and she's super sweet. See, Jam and the Dave 360 on your ass. I was dying. So good. LA Knight's entrance was too perfect as well. My kids love LA Knight. Let's go. Jam, not too bad. We had you in TCW uh, title. I didn't win, but you definitely kicked some butt. <laughs> Thank you, Queen. I know you've been super supportive. All of you, actually. Joe, Dave, thank you for checking Abby. 
And, and Dave, let's get a shout out for Dave here. Uh, we're doing the community thingy. Dave, as you know, is my homie. He's a brother. He's such a cool guy. Uh, he's the one that made me lose my shit and become a completionist. Why? I used, I used to only care about rolling credits and, and getting some plats for the games I love. But now it has to be everything. Game that I touch, game that I, I, makes me lose sleep. I, I don't know. Creep's going to be a, a problem for them. We're going to figure it out. But yeah, go follow Dave, a.k.a. Clipless Grenade. He's uh, doing the God Gamer Challenge. Already on the seventh game playing East Origin. And after East Origin, we have Super Meat Boy, Wolfenstein 2, and finally, the Coup de Gras, the thing to finish the game of all games. God Gamer game of all God Gamer games. Creed of the Necro Dancer. He gonna creep, fellas. Let's see, non-binary house. Everyone today, I'm doing good. How we're doing? How, how we're doing good today as well, non-binary. Happy Thursday. See, so gonna go get my ass kicking. Rabbi Ribi. Oh shit, you're playing Rabbi Ribi. I know that's a Lambda approved game. See, Jim, I wasn't hugely a fan until I saw more of him lately, and he's a good one. I have to admit, though, I've always been like a brave fan, so seeing this past row got me very hyped. Freshly frosted. I think I saw someone play that. Oh, that's a donut game. We play that here. That's a good game. If you like puzzles, very like cozy and chill. I don't think I have it on Epic. I have it on Steam, so I'm going to claim it anyways. But that's a fun little game. Yeah, go get Freshly Frosted. That's the name of Needy's Smex tape. Let's go. Freshly Frosted and Oiled. So, like, shiny. I admittedly don't watch more wrestling, but I will support the kiddos. See, Young Monk. Young Monk. By the way, uh, Gem, I need to put your big beady emote let's do that because you know everything and fury climbed actually look we were checking the pasta arta oh shit there's carly oh my god there's so many goodies here but look fury i know you've been you and nate are the ones boosting fury a lot one position up number 16 that's pretty high that guarantees i'll play fury before i draw my last breath so keep it up fury it is let me get those in here. And Willie didn't say hi. How are you doing, Willie? There's chat got lit for a sec. I'm trying to catch up still. But we're doing good, Willie. Happy Thursday. Let's see, Gem. The 15 Fury Beats. That's all. Catch up to chat. The, the pie. Majora's mass boat noise. See, happy Friday Eve. Let's go, Willie. Hope you're having a great day. Welcome to the stream. Riva Duba Wuba, Andy Caramela. How you doing, Andy? Shout out for Willie. Willie, I met him recently thanks to uh, Coldman on the X platform. Now we are acquaintances here on Twitch as well. How you doing, Willie? Good to see you. Welcome to the stream. And be sure to support our fellow creators. Willie is a pretty cool guy. I'm getting to know him, uh, but uh, my interactions have been nothing but sweet and positive. So be sure to show that Rips Rack brand love. Let's go. Uh, Andy, how about you? How are you doing today? Mordor's Shadow. You know, you just wasted six votes. I don't know that game. That's not on my list. Let's see. No, I'm just kidding. Your vote's fine. Let's see. Da the Fahi. No, Daffy not here anymore. He's playing Ribi Rabi. See, Jim, good. We got Miso, Geeking Goddess, and Curly done yesterday. Oh, shit. I need to see those models. I just have Tia and the unknown left for the TCW women's roster and the unknown for the JWF men's and we are fucking up. When's the event? When's the, 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 the real deal? I gotta be there. We need to get shoutouts for Gem and Juice. They are working together on the new um, wrestling event. It's gonna be even better. You say the Pahi. See, don't worry. Silson is never coming out, so you get to play Creed forever. No, I will get to play Creed until July 31st. I want to play something else as well, but we won't stop. I need to. This is gonna uh, be a practice, a, a daily practice affair for me for a while. See, Queen, I posted a video in Discord. It's one of the models we have in this lab right now. In the lab right now, it's a miniature of a dam in the USA. I did not work on this model, but it's super impressive. Oh shit! I want to take a look. Oh, I'm almost, almost caught up with Chad. See, no are doing good. Today's Peppermint's birthday, so we're celebrating that tonight. Oh, happy birthday, Peppermint. And then, uh, what do you have planned for tonight? And then there's their planning on having their uh, first three. Oh, shit. What's the channel? What's the channel, non-binary? Uh, we need to do shouties. They've been working their butt off getting things set up, making art assets and stuff. That's so exciting. The first stream is always, always exciting. 
See Willy saying hi to Timmy. What kind of Daffy demonic variant is that? From one of the nine hells. See uh, to kind Riva. No, Willy, thank you for being here with us. Yeah, we have the Willy here. And Timmy too. And Jim. I think you're just looking at October currently. Exact date to be determined. Okay, well, we need to pay attention to that. Uh, let me get a shout out here before checking back the showcase for Gemini. Thank you, Jim, for hanging out. The channel is Peppermint Lark. Okay, let's do this as well. I might follow already. If I don't, let's fix this right now. Nice, we see some asses. Let's go. Riva is follower number four. Let's go, guys. If you want to follow Peppermint to support them on their upcoming first stream, we're going to have that uh, happening soon, probably. So let us know, non binary, when it's. And remember to use Discord. I know you're already there. So you can tag here me on the showcase when it's happening or the Twitch promotion, but be sure to tag me so I don't miss it. Let's see. The calendar. Oh shit, Daffy, Daffy. Remember Monday, next Monday, Daffy, the overlap. We have RPG with the Trails in the Sky 20th anniversary. That's epic. Let's see what we have here. And good job on the pasta art. Duo, did you see this? This is Yasumi Matsuno-san. This is a producer of Final Fantasy Tactics. Today's Zero Signal's birthday. Oh shit. Double tactics boats. We need to get Zero in here. Oh shit, you're right. The 20th of June. And tomorrow is Cedar Crest. Tomorrow is Cedar. What is this? The producer of Final Fantasy Tactics to celebrate today's the 27th anniversary of Final Fantasy Tactics. Riba, Goog, what's up, Stinky? How you doing? So he shares some prototype screenshots. Look at how different. Kind of looks more like Unicorn Overlord. But this is some cool pixel art. And I know you like tactics a lot. Look at this. A behemoth. The, the white mage, knights and shit, teeth. So cool, man. Uh, this looks dope as fuck. I will play the shit out of this game, but this game never existed because it became a different game altogether, which is fine because it's a fantastic game. But this does look super cool. Looks more ogre, ogre battle or something like that. Why is that BB so big? Because it's not a BB, it's a black mage. That's a fucking let's go, let's go. The chocobo is massive. This looks really cool. I will play the hell out of this. See, Stinky, how you doing? And I wanted to share it because I know we have a lot of nerds that are fans of tactics here as well. Nitty always being grumpy. This looks fine. I prefer the fucking game. It sucks. The one we have is better. Gave us Teta. Nitty likes Teta. Doing good. Close to a thousand now. And they'll be rising 100%. Let's go. How are you all? Uh, I'm doing good, Stink. I'm happy to see you. Let me get a shout out for... We got Gem. I need to get one for look at all the juice. We need to get Willy. We need to get Stinky. We need to get Lambda Delta. We need to get Andy Caramela. Duo. Duo doesn't need shout outs. Everyone here follows Duo. No, I'm kidding. I need to shout out Duo. Duo is playing a Final Fantasy VII Remake as well. Which I love. So what else we got here? But yeah, go follow you. Progress shot, Carly. Two more colors left. Almost there. So just one more shade of purple here and one more shade of blue here and you are done. That's freaking awesome, Carly. You've been working on this piece for a while. Lick those liquors. Oh man, Jam, that emo is barely legal. That emo there is barely legal, man. I don't know how you haven't gotten in trouble yet. I guess Dan Clancy has favorites. Huh. You are too cute to not be a favorite. Let's see, minty progress. Nice. Now I can totally see the progress. The, the feathers and the tail here in the peacock looking gorgeous. This is so much work, minty. I'm so, so um, impressed by the dedication to this. It's looking really cool. Very beautiful texture. 
Under the radar? Huh, you say so. M. So cute. What is this? Filigree, right? Looks so cool. Commission from my, my daughter did for a client whose dog has... Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. But that's a super cute puppy portrait. Mo. Is Mo the name of the puppy? Man, I mean, your, your daughter is so talented. Is she the one that, that... The same one that did the animation for you? The Hollow Knight animation? Seems really impressive. You keep fostering that talent. Really cool stuff. This is lovely. Shout out the puppy passing off. Yo, shit, Iris, is this the model you mentioned it? That's freaking huge. That's freaking fucking huge. That's so cool. Kind of like power dam. I imagine. Yo, that's really fucking dope, uh, Isa. You know, I, I love all sorts of like engineering things. I'm, I always get excited about watching this stuff in in action. Damn, damn. <laughs> that's a big damn, right? Damn, damn, damn. Big damn, bro. Can can you take a? Uh, uh, you can you skinny deep there? Mm, no ribs. It goes. It goes against regulations. It goes against regulations. Would not recommend. Not gonna lie. I was expecting to see a peace stream on the camera, but <laughs> God damn it, Jim. Oh God, no. Uh, super cute art for their channel. Oh shit. That's and it's everything homemade, or did they commission an artist for that? Looks super cute. Toss a coin if you can. That's cute. The rules of admin. That's so cool. Um, no more. Thank you for sharing. You need to let us know when the stream happens so I can try to be there. They do all that. That's so cool. You know, I really admire that stuff. That's a, You know, that's another reason. And to the people that were worried that if I get a job, I will stop streaming. That I will never stop streaming because, you see, this stuff enriches my life so much. And it inspires me. And it also... Uh, makes me proof like you learn so much from doing this and from in, in many many aspects like you learn from yourself you learn and get to know other people and practical stuff to skills technical stuff software if you get into editing or making new art and it's just it's really cool no they make them here in the lab uh, then it wouldn't make difference if it was a piece either ribs you gave me luck what happened what, happened? what, what, what did i do j1 my company specializes in miniatures. Well, not so miniature. Maybe compared to the real deal, but that's still pretty huge. I was talking with Kish Gal and with your stream in the background, and finally got him. Let's go. Okay, now pay up. You think this is free? This is not a charity I'm running here. Now you're just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. One. I, I, the freeloaders. They run, do all those freeloader shit. That's the one. Good job. You are almost there. Almost there. See, stinky. So we got juice. Let me get shout out for the stinkiest of minkies. And I think we're ready. Let's play some crypt. Man, it's already noon. I mean, one hour and 28 minutes. I'm gonna have lunch, but let me death metal. Holy shit! Holy fuck! Lambda! I'm, I'm gaming. Do you see that? One shot at death metal. No miss beat. You brought me luck to one. Clip that shit. Just, okay guys, the stream is over. 100% win rate today. Do you see that, queen? There's a flex right there. God damn, no. Now let me switch to 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 Cadence over. <laughs> now we're gonna die with we're gonna die with the blues. We gaming. You see, I told you. 
Willy, that doesn't happen often. This song is so hard to keep the beat. Teaches you to be a better person. Fucking queen. Not you, queen. The queen in the, in the chest. You are my friend. I love queen. Just not this queen that just shafted me. That's bad. You don't go back. Why did he move up? That was a good run. How did you do that Google? I got good, man. I got good because you're here, John. Everyone's here with you. Shit, don't step on money. So much morning at lunchtime. Oh, you love that nitty. Da -da -da -da. I'm Willy, did I get the shout for you? I think I did. Yeah, we did. Who am I missing? We got Stinky, we got Gem, look at all the juice. Oh, we haven't done Duo. Yo, yo, yo. Duo MTL. Follow at your own risk, though. We got Abby as well. Dave. This is definitely harder than death metal. At first I was like lambda is really harder than death metal. Way harder. Death metal. Just too fast. It's not too hard. Oh, oh that was a mistake. I need to keep a path open there. The sound that he makes when the, the cats close his balls. That was dumb. I had it under control, but I'm still I'm still making progress. Oh no! I blocked myself. Don't do that. Yeah, when, when the cat and Nidhi goes oh, and says, cat out, perfect Brazilian, you know. Nando. I mean, Nidhi has a ton of cats. I don't know what was that, but I, that was not good. I love gold, but not stepping on it with color. Damn, this is so hard, dude. It's rock solid boner hard. Why do I do that stupid shit and get blocked? Oof, the pawn. Dead by pawn, lame. No, you don't need to feel bad.
Let's fucking go. Very slowly. How long for about five minutes? Conga is fairly easy, but so worth practicing. Songs are banger. Man, stupid bat. It's easy, they say. Okay, Congo one door. Mm. Coral Reef. So good, man. I keep doing that. I got soaked the water. Ooh, sandwich. It's better to just not go in. Man. I went full Google mode. I went full Google mode. You see that shit, Neri? I had the win, man. My routine now I have to go up and down some stairs. Good luck with that pasta, careful. While you're taking care of your head. Ta -ta -ta -ta. 
The final is even for this. Ambitions are cavernous. That sounds spicy. I'm I'm gonna do the battle and go eat lunch. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. Oh shit, we got non binary Sparky, Cleo, Gemini Tiger, and Jung Monk. Nice. It's a nice army. Thank you guys for reading. Computer farted crazy. Gem and non binary. Two for you, non binary. One for you. Set up a new battle. I'm gonna go eat uh, my lunch real quick. I'll see you in like 15 minutes or so. I'll claim this later. I think we can do some runs. Let's see what happens. We go to zone two already. Back fellas, no anywhere.
Nate, bro. God damn. How you guys doing? Uh, I'm back. Google. Nate, guess what, bro? I got a death metal kill one shot like who? That that means that I'm definitely improving. You know, I always had to do a few runs. I mean, how do you watch how do you watch a stream? I can't take this message. One pin. Bro, it was check this out. I can't take this. Message. You can't go back. One pin. Bro, it was check this out. I it blew my mind. I can't take this. You can find that. Part and fourteen. I got a deep blues too. Uh, the same one that. Oh, the damn. You know, I. Mm. That's a nice dam there. You nice know, I really have off and reaches. Nice looking dam. How are you doing, Nate? To make different if it was a piece either. Reeves, you gave me luck. What happened? What happened? One, I mean, one hour and 28 minutes. Okay, check this out. Check this out. Really? Like, just jump into the game for just chatting. Metal. Look at this. Death metal. Face of course, look at that. Bomb. Boom. Holy shit, man. Holy shit! <laughs> Holy fuck! Lambda! Oh my god, you couldn't see. I'm, I'm so I'm dumb. gaming. Do you see that? I'm, let, me, let me show you again, don't worry. Big steak, lol. Oh my god, you see? Six years of streaming? It's not good enough. Doesn't teach me how to do this. I, I will show you, Nate. Sorry for that. Let's try again. You are almost there. Oh. And I think we're. Okay. Check this out. Now you can see, right? I have lunch, but let me death metal. Look, there's fake Riva or Riva before in time. I watch that execution. That's just me fighting the game. Holy shit! Holy fuck! Lambda! I, I had to call Lambda like... <laughs> Bro, that was exciting. Nate, how are you doing? God damn, I wasn't showing it. First try is... Okay, let's play some... Woo! Exactly, because you know what you're doing, right? But I know what I'm doing. Let me... Only nastiness about disabling this DLC is that we saw what happened to the golems. But I feel like today we can get a run. Cadencia, let's go. Very good. Let's try this out, Willy. How you doing, Nate? I need a shout out for Nate, the exterminator. Of course, it's locked. Of course it's locked! There's also some morning meetings and some good changes going on. Okay, good to hear. I also might have good news about the job, but... I won't count my blessings until it's happening. I got a call today during the stream. It was like 15 minute call. And now I got an email with the same people, so I'm gonna check it out in a bit. But I wanna play a little bit. Until Low percent, don't touch it. Fuck bro. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
I ate chicken breast. Mm, breast. Yeah, this guy, I prefer to kill him. I want don't loot bomba. You see that? You see that? You see that? Ooga. Use a bomb. Ta ta ta. Riva learning after 900 hours. Ooga. We kinda play a game. Oh shit. Ah, out of my way. Monkey! I wanna jump down here. Risk factor. Donkey Kong. Hey, it's called a rip, sorry. I say? Well, Donkey Kong is coming back to Switch. But it's a whole different story. Tatanuga. No! I should shut up and not enjoy the song and just win. Let's try to line here. Super Guga Battle in six minutes. Big say you say you're working, tons of work. Any any news you can give us? Yuka, how you doing? Good to see you. Yuka, I got a really clean death metal kill. First thing, no death. Let's go. I'm slowly learning how to play the game. Thank you for the good luck. Oh shit. You need some sleep? Well, we'll get your rest, Yuka. We want to rest at Yuka. I think they released a demo for Rift of the Necro Dancer, by the way. Don't do that. Oh shit, your stream? When is happening? I want to see that. Big dick. Casey said it. I missed it. I encourage you to try, it's so good. So damn good. Can't give any details, but suffice to say I played the game and it's fucking awesome. Not sure I can say when it's coming up soon, but I can Yeah exactly. Once you know the date you're allowed to say Let the river know. Can we co-stream that? The Ripsa will love to watch the big dick. I imagine we can, but you don't need to ask. It's cook. <laughs> cook. I don't know how to play this game. I, I am gaming, and then the next second I suck. Staying in a state of weak gaming is hard. Nitty knows. Mm. 
Muy bien. I hear bosses. There you are. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. We kind of get the color rifle. Dun, 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 dun. All that chicken breast. The breast got stuck in my throat. Oh shit! Do you hear just what, what you said? Gotta be careful then. Got the breast is stuck in my throat. Chicken breast. You dirty motherfuckers. I hope you got good news on the job, I hope it's not here. Dude, whatever I get. <coughs> God damn it. I'm gonna jump if it works for me from a salary perspective and conditions, but I am I'm excited. Hopefully this moves forward. Yeah, I gotta be very careful with that breast. But thank you, Nate. I know you Oh no, that suck mage. Always bro. I know if I get a clear, it's gonna be clenched like that. Oh, thank you, Nate. You've been so kind to me, man. Getting red bats before the seven of DLC. I don't remember to learn. Now we have more red. It pains me not to be able to get those bombs. Guys are terrible. <clears throat> Battle ready. Hello there. Stupid decisions were made. Let's do the battle. Tararin, tararin, tururi, tararan, tararan, tararari. The exterminate. Shout out. Nate, you are M. Guys, Nate has a goal for 500 followers. By year's end. It's already 360. Holy shit, man. I'm so happy. Guys, if anyone here in the rift like, hasn't met Nate, hasn't followed Nate, so he's a cool guy. I'm so happy I got to meet him. 
Very fun streamer. Also a hunter. Getting some cool games hunted. Very cool guy. Say so, my folks got a Bansai tree. I'm getting. I mind you mean bonsai because bonsai is what you say. Bonsai is like when you know the kamikaze fighters are gonna kill themselves and shit. Bonsai. It's probably bonsai. Yeah, that thing. Sorry, Rio. Like that bonsai tree. Dur, I know. <laughs> Duder, Duder. Thank you for the shout. No man, dude. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being here. See, gem and non-binary. Young man, when you hear the word relleno, what comes to mind? Sex. That's what comes to mind. Sex. Steamy, delicious sex. The kind that is like mind blowing. That's what comes to mind when I hear relleno. What, what does come to your mind? Relleno is a very. It's, an, it's not a, a, a spicy or naughty word, but. That, that it's feeling. That's what it means. Like you have a turkey, you know, you, you put this stuff, the turkey with some delicious stuff. That's the relleno. But it also, it makes me think about sex. Sorry, you asked me what comes to mind. I, I was being honest with you. You didn't ask about food specifically. Relleno. Mm, 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 yums. So good. Da, 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 da. Mage. Well, since we have some folks, I'm going to try dropping a mage. Let's see what happens. John Monk's relleno. Okay. Tasty. Back to square one. Chata. Nuga. Chata. Chata. Nuga. Chata. Chata. Nuga. Bats. I was talking with a friend, he brought it up. I thought he meant a Puerto Ricanese. Puerto Ricanese? Is, is it not just Puerto Rican? Puerto Ricanese. That's such a word. Well, there's a Mexican. There's probably a different relleno in every Latin American country. Some might be similar. Like the Puerto Ricanese, maybe similar to like other Caribbean rellenos, you know? You have a mastery of language. It's impressive stuff. Perfect, we go down. Oh, your favorite debug meeting. Let's go. You live for that shit. That's what you enjoy the most. That cold running smoothly, baby. That probably gives you a bone. Bye. Hello. Oh my god. Got him. GI does exactly, especially after the stroll. Oh, it's working! Can take people to the moon. It is that mission critical. Let's go. is a golden. This guy needs to die. Not you, that, that spirit. I hear dragon. King Kong 
Mission Critical Rebo. This is King Kong, guys. Tan, tan. Also known as Kok. Left, right, left. Get away from me, Red Bat. Boom, take that. Monkey. Monkey Dad. Tan, 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 tan. This is so fucking good, right? Dude, I'm so happy you can try the demo so we can talk about the demo. If it's out there, we can talk about it. Because I've been playing for a while, but it is so good, man. And I imagine it's gonna be super duper hard as well. What songs are in the demo, Casey? Is Amalgamaniac there? Bro, that's. Tan, 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 taran, tan, tan. That music is great, yeah. No surprises, no spoilers. As expected. And the animations are so crisp. Surprise demo mode. Mushi. Okay. No, I had him next to me. One, two, three. Casey of the Necrodancer. Let's go. Two red bats?
All Good Friend y Blues. And if Koda had no gold drops, it would be so much easier. It would be pointless though. Oh, why did I move? Oh. Oh, sandwiched. Show monster. Oh, show monster and and monk and Nate have stories to tell. So good. You're not the only one that needs to get good. Riva has skill issues. Terrible, terrible gameplay. Not a level of Riva gameplay you're used to. Five seconds, beautiful. No peace ring. Fuck it. to fire a red dial. Typical Riva two times, and now we get Queen. I am very sad. Other than the death metal kill. And a deep blue skill and a color reef. Not happy with this. I need to do a high performance gaming session too. Yeah, that was so bad, dude. Oh no, I'm red down. I wanna get cooked. Monkey, okay. Go up here. Oh shit. Well, you can't complain too much about the face tanking because you're kind of face tanking in Final Fantasy VII too. But you're like, this is a small fry enemies. I don't care. I just want to get this fight over so we can move on the story. So many enemies. <laughs> it's a lot of fun watching you play Final Fantasy. I'm glad you're having fun with it. Eight chapters in. Ah, you will learn. You will learn. The, the combat system really shines in the hard mode. I had a lot of fun with it in hard. I enjoyed it more. It became my favorite um, 
my favorite uh, square action RPG system, to be honest. This side of East, East is my favorite RP action RPG combat. But the Final Fantasy VII Rhythmic is pretty top notch too. Especially in hard, it shines. And I've heard Rebirth is even better. I haven't played Rebirth yet. I need to play that. And you will see, it's not too bad. Once you start getting used to like the shortcuts and... And that's, and switching is, is fine. Willy, I gotta be a lurky turkey for a bit. Hey Willy, thank you so much for hanging out. I don't know how much uh, longer I'll go, because as you know, I'm still in the pro- Oh shit. I, I might have- Oh, I'm so bad. Yeah, the face tanking is not working. I might need to do some emails and interviews and stuff, so... Oh, it's bad, that's it. And like you said, the graphics are so pretty in the game, man. They give you Tifa. Tifa Gorge. What the hell is a shrine? They playing this vanilla ass version of the game. No return shrine. Something like that. Can't, can't, can't touch it though. I wanna try something. What do you wanna? Oh sh! What do you wanna try? Don't pose your dick, please. I know you're your. Can't wait to share it again, but young munch is longer. Oh no! Okay, this is bad. It's not affected by water. But if it can be a dick. <laughs> oh my god, it's cool. Enlarge this, not. <laughs> oh, I'm so dumb, man. I mean, I'm having a lot of fun. Oh, he's gonna go up. That. He won't get bigger. Should I jump down? Nah, that's totally gonna be a red dragon. Fuck me. Dude, just keep coming, huh? There's my dragon. Does anyone have a these nuts emo that you can put in chat bigger these nuts? Da, da, da. Or git good? I certainly could use some git good. He says, ooh. Oh shit! Yeah. 
I smell exit over here. Oops. That's not. If they give you traps, you use traps. Especially for old men that suck. I got scared when I saw the Rolly down there, but I need... Ah. I'm the only one boarding Hyper Rogue on date. It's a bit pixelated, but... Man, I hear boss. Where? There you go. One. Three. Four. One. Two. Oh. Jump down. Ooh. That's not the one you were trying to send. Goog. I need to add a Beatis or Fury. Fury is on, on a roll here. Beautiful Dibros. Beautiful Dibros. Do speak. Come on, Oh shit, Skelly. What are you doing? Wait your turn. Man, this is 
gymnastic this year. Yesterday we got to the Necro Dancer. Today I'm just dying in Zone 2. I think I saw Zone 3 once. Face tanking. Duo robbed on me. The wrong way, of course. And, and making bad choice because I dug myself my own grader. Like, why did I corner myself? There was space. Queen, 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 queen. No more soccer, man. I, I'm sucking a lot. I'm trying, I'm trying. On the one hand, I'm gaming that death metal kill was smooth. And I'm making terrible choices here. Okay, first floor clear, 32 seconds, not too bad. Try to keep it up. I gotta learn to be efficient. Let's jump down here. Stupid bad. Can still survive. Don't take more hits. Dun, dun. Giga Kappa is so pixelated, man. <laughs> Damn it! H how come you you can't pick the emo you want? That doesn't make sense. That's Casey's face. Low resolution version. Oh, thank you, John, for that. Kappa. You see a teke teke teke. Looks very like an old DOS game. Yeah, you gotta use the regular cap. Leo, thanks for the epic artillery unit. No, no, I'm dead. I'm dead, two monkeys. You see, duo, getting terrible choices here. Oh, better to HCB as well? I don't think it works. I think it needs to be a Twitch emo cell. Like, those are outsourced. Or even, uh, they're not on Twitch. Young Monk's experiments. So 45, let's go. 41. 42 seconds. Let's go. No. Bats everywhere. Okay, Complete with annoying spirit. I have to get it to work, but once it means some more reverse back. Oh wait, can you change code on that stuff? Do you work for Twitch? Shut up, Rivo. <laughs> That's super mission critical. You know my dirty secret now. Oh shit, spirits! 
That was a nice wait. Fucking crap. You see that? Waiting on Jutsu. I'm proud of myself. You might not understand what just happened there, but that's a sign of maturity as a creep player. Being able to let beats go. So hard to do. I use it all the time. Be a good player. Bad, get away from me. Left, right, left, right, left. Ooh. Take that monkey. Ooh. Faster, 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 faster. Man, these old fellas are so dangerous. They, they come together. I can't, man. I can't, man. Let's see. Maybe because I'm scattered all over the place with the with the job hunt, with the with the crossfit, with the achievements, with the just chatting. It's, it's a complicated time for Riva. But I won't give you excuses. I have to deliver. Let's do uh, John here. I'm going to go and see the 15, 15 uh, banjo. Thank you so much, dude. Let's do our battle. The binary gem and sparkly cloud. Make more pork barbecue, gonna be noise. That sounds nice, man. You know, I love pork, it's a great source of protein as well. I can have some good fats, you can get it pretty lean, depending. Pork is amazing, I love pork. Oh man, you find the most pixelated emos. Let's go, pixelated gas. Thank you for that pixelated cheese. Look at how pixelated that is, dude. Low resolution, more fucker than John.
Let's see, the votes are for Cleo and non-binary. Big sex. You have to. You know what you have to do, right? If you make the the barbecue, take pictures. I always get so so uh, hungry. I start leaking the screen when you post those feasts. A man can cook and eat. Let's go. Cleo. See if we can find. Raid here, Raid Browser. Da -da -da. Boxophone, Bioshock 2 Remastered. Da -da -di -di -ba -ba -di. Reaper's Pass is playing Hollow Knight. Bro, 112 comfort game. Dude, let's raid Reapers. Let's raid Reapers pass here. That, um... Playing some Hollow Knight. Oh, I can see chat. What happened to chat? This is so buggy, man. Do you guys see chat? The like chat got reset. Well, there's rate one if you're subscribed, rate two if you're not subscribed. Or traditional rip rack, moist and spice message. But you can use anything you want if you have any other emos you love. We're gonna rate our friend Reaper's Pass here. He's playing some Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight is such a fun game. You know, Nate, I almost went down the rabbit hole yesterday when I switched briefly to Hollow Knight. Um, maybe I should stream that after this is over. Um, try to get all the Radiant bosses. Just for fun. Should be fun. Um, with that said, thank you all for coming. Let's see. Um, thank you, John, for the Guy Gunt Gugantify emotes. Nate, Pasta, LG Thames, 07 Bro. Duo, yo yo, Andy Caramella, non binary. Gem also made a giant bot emo today. Thank you, Gem. Clipless Grenade, Daffy, Queen, uh, Nitty Meatus, Nando Meatus, Minty Pie, Devilman, Kurt Chemical Van, Lambda. Oh shit, Ray's pushing through. Won't have time to uh, say thank you to all, but thank you guys. Let's Ray Reapers, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.